Hello everyone, welcome back again with me on third Konego channel. Today in this video, I will show you how to static analyze C clamp like this. We will know the various attractive force that occur. And without wasting time, let's start it. First step, we choose best clamp material. Go to material, go to edit material. Choose Cast Alloy Steel Click Apply Close Go to Add Ins Active SolidWorks Simulation Go to Simulation Click New Study Make file name is Static C Clamp OK Because we just analyzed base clamp, exclude this part Right click Click exclude from analyst. After that, go to feature. Click fix geometry. Click this face. OK. Insert external load. Click force. Click this face. Click selected direction. Click this direction Click this face for direction Make force value parameter is 500 Newton Ok Now, we create a mass Right click mass Click Create Mesh Check Mesh Parameter Choose Standard Mesh OK After Mesh done, click Run this analysis After done, we know the highest stress value in this area. Right click stress result, create edit definition, choose MPA unit, click true skull, go to chart option, check show max annotation, choose floating, make 2 after comma, ok. See? And stress value is 175.75 MPa, where your strength value is 241.26 MPa. It means that the C-clamp is still safe and not at risk of breaking. Now, go to displacement. Right click Displacement, go to Edit Definition, click True Scale, check Show Max Annotation, choose Floating, make 2 after comma, OK. See, the maximum displacement is 2.13 mm. Now, we see factor of safety. Right click result. Click define factor of safety plot. Choose all. Click next. Click next. See, minimum factor of safety is 1.38. OK. Right click Factor of Safety, click Setting, go to Chart Option, choose Floating, 2 after Comma, 
Okay. See, factor of safety value is 1.39. I think it's the end tutorial. I hope you like it and can learn solid work using my video tutorial. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.